Very good morning. The second teachers, honorable chief guests, and my dear friends. I am Sneha Yadav from Kut PG College of PA First Year. Today I am here and got the opportunity to speak and express my ideas about the topic whether there should be any laws implemented for the restriction of population growth. So according to me, there should be laws to be implemented for the restriction of population growth. As we can see the reports of United Nations World Population Census of 2022, it is mentioned that the world population is 8 billion, in which India's population is 1.41 billion, which is the second highest population. And China's population is 1.42 billion, which is the most highest population in the world. But as we can see the reports, it is also mentioned that in the upcoming years, the India population is going to cross the China's population and become the largest populous country in the world. There are many reasons that can say that the population growth should be restricted. That are, there is the difference of birth rate and death rate. Earlier, there was a balance between the birth rate and death rate. But as the reports we can see from Niti Ayo, it is mentioned that the birth rate has been increased by 1.22% and the death rate has been decreased by 8.6%. The other thing we can mention that there is also the greed for a boy. There are many people in the society who think that the family can only be run by the power of a boy. And for that greed, after having many girls as a child, still they want a boy. And that, that problem uh, facing in the country. Our next point can be, there are many people who are uneducated and stereotyped. They think that the children are not gifted. So, this may increase the population. Now, let me mention the effects of population growth. There are many effects of population growth. There can be depletion in the natural resources. As you can see, the natural resources that are trees, land, they are limited. But as the population is growing, the people are cutting the trees and building their houses, farms for their own use. And the production of grains has been declined as the lands that are used for the production of grains has been taken by the population. And after that, as you can see, as the population is increasing, there is poverty level defined by Human Development Index. Human Development Index has mentioned that the population increase is causing poverty in the country and economic growth backwardness. There is also some solutions that we can see and we can also practice it to uh, for uh, population, overpopulation, to cure overpopulation. That are for better education, we should make people aware about the uh, uh, better way of family planning. There should not be any gender discrimination. As we can take the example of China. In China, the China's uh, government has taken uh, there is not incentive of one child policy in 1980. But later it was, uh, in 2015 it was cancelled as, as the population of uh, old people increased than the youngsters. Then again, 2016, China imposed two child policy and still it is going on. Recently, India has passed a bill, for, uh, not passed, sorry, it was uh, some introduction of bill for two child policy in the Parliament of India. And according to that, only people with two child will get the jobs and other uh, state incentives. So, for the conclusion, I will mention that there should be laws implemented for the uh, population growth.